Police are investigating vandalism at Philadelphia's historic Mother Bethel AME Church. A message to the congregation said somebody threw rocks into the lower windows of the church in Society Hill. Happened sometime between Sunday morning service and yesterday morning. And joining us now, the pastor of Mother Bethel, Reverend Mark Kelly Tyler. Thanks so much for speaking mm -hmm. with us, Pastor Tyler. Yeah, thank you for having me. Good morning to the both of you. Good morning. So we know Mother Bethel is historic. It's on the oldest parcel of land continuously owned by African-Americans in this country. So what were you thinking when you first found out that this church was damaged? Well, I think the first thing that runs into your mind, given the way that the world is now with uh, synagogues being attacked, mosques and masjids being attacked, that this is something that is political in nature. But uh, I was relieved you know, again, and mind you, I have to, you know, kind of put that, you know, qualify that statement as relieved as you can be when your church has been vandalized, that it appeared to be the work of just one person who literally was just out doing something. He probably did not even realize uh, what Mother Bethel is, what it means to so many people. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, you, your, your mind immediately goes to the worst case scenario. And I think we can all uh, breathe a sigh of relief knowing that that's probably not the case here. Yeah, the congregation is resilient there, obviously, because of the history of vandalism uh, several times. Of course, you mentioned it, Aaron. You know, the church founded in the late 1700s. Um, how has the congregation come together as a result of this? Well, uh, as you just said, I mean, listen, Mother Bethel has uh, faced challenges of vandalism and attempted vandalism since its founding in the 1700s. Uh, there were riots, race riots that happened on Lombard Street in the 1800s. There, you know, plenty of evidence of it. And each time the congregation comes together. And so this is not, again, the first time in mm -hmm. the modern era that this has happened. And each time we do what we have to do, we pick up the glass, pick up the broken pieces, and we, you know, again, put things back where they're supposed to be, and we move on. I want to just say quickly how appreciative I am on behalf of the members for the Philadelphia community. My inbox has been flooded, text messages, phone calls and everything else from fellow clergy, from elected officials, retired elected officials, from foundations, all offering to step up and help and do whatever they can do. And as one person said, Philadelphia is with Mother Bethel, and we love that. Oh, yeah. That's right. Philly comes together. That's what we do. Reverend yep. Mark Kelly Tyler, thank you so much for being with us this morning. Good to see you. So early, too. Thank you.